Merry Christmas from the You Dizzy Show. I'm changing this water heater. It burst on the floor in here. So I got a bucket full. I went and bought a new water heater. And now I got to connect the, the cold and hot and, you know, connect it all back up. That's what I'm doing. All installed. New fittings on the top. Yeah, it is all installed. Up on the blocks. New shut offs. Direct lines. That's how it's done. I'm not sure you're going to be able to see it, but uh, they got the bridge lit up today. You see the bridge? It's all lit up green on both sides. Aw. It's looking pretty. Looking pretty on both I sides. Think it changes. Does Sometimes. it change? Oh, Just there was, in the morning, it's there was red. Ambulance. See what happens to the lights? They blink like that, so that the signals change for the ambulances way. Oh, oh! Now we get the green light. This is the Shrewsbury Bridge going into Shrewsbury, Massachusetts. See these? Look at that. This is going over over Quinsigamond Lake. In the night times. Oh, they look they look pretty. I guess they change different colors different days or something. Yeah, in the morning when I go to work I can see them from that stoplight all the way up there. They're red. Well, I brought this axle down here uh, to the basement, uh, Harvey, and uh, I lined it up w with the rear end here, and it, I had to cut out that centerpiece because I was going to try to cut these clean and uh, clean this up and slide them into here, okay? So, you know, so it would be both of those would slide right in. But the problem is, is these barons seems to be fixed. They don't slide up and down on this shaft. So I'm not sure if this is going to work. And I got to soak all these bolts. I, I can't move any of them without stripping them. Well, maybe these two big ones. but uh, And none of these I can move without stripping them unless I soak them. So I'm going to get that to soak in and... Uh, Whatnot, and here's something else to think about. I'm looking at this tire set up here, and then I look at this motor. Javi, Javi, that's 390 cc's. I'm not sure this rear end is even gonna hold up. <laughs> I mean. If I can get this to work, if I can get these to slide, I can take these hubs off and weld this plate right to a bigger wheel. You know, and that would be cool. But we're going to have to see how that goes. As you see, I'm still working on the toolbox, little by little. I've been getting so busy and doing all kinds of things, bouncing here, bouncing there. I haven't had no time in the shop. It's dirty as hell. I broke a bunch of drill bits. i got to get some replacements. These ones suck anyways. But I got a case here, but some of them I had, I had broken. But that's a Harbor Freight special, so you know how that goes. And a buddy of mine was wondering about his stickers. You see, I do have the bullets. And I am going to look for that sticker. I did look before, but I didn't find it. 
Danger high voltage. Custom, what's that say? Custom exhaust. Wicked pisser sticker. I don't seem to see it. Detroit. Oh, not that one. It's not those. Rob's pack and shine. Can't seem to find it. I thought if I had those, the bullets, I would have the sticker down here. So, and if he sent that, he must have sent the sticker. Well, I'm gonna have to look for that. Anyways, that's what you did. He's working on now. I'm gonna try to uh, lube this all up with some uh, with some juice and uh, see if I can break those free along with sanding the inside trays of this and such on and so forth. You know, bouncing around. Well, I lubed that all up. I'm going to let it sit for a while. And I started working on these. <coughs> the way these work is this has a little lip in it all the way down right here that this one here clips into all right so i actually got this to look good down the uh down the whole style so it was a lot of hammering a lot of tapping tapping and i still gotta do a little more fixing hair and grinding and stuff that's where that crack was but I got it to join up nicely now I just need to take this piece again and uh, I'd fix everything that's wrong with it this needs cut out and a new piece put in here you know that's just garbage but this one here this one uh other than this piece is broken off, I'll have to weld a little piece on there. It's still got the, the pad on it, the, the rubber pad they had on it. And it's in good shape. It's got a bend right here that I gotta take out. A kink in it. But other than that, it, it looks pretty good. So I'm gonna clean this one up. That one's a survivor. This one's a survivor that needs patched down the bottom. So, then I'm going to probably have to make some of these brackets or something and weld them on. Because these are just garbage. You know, that one may work, but this one's garbage, you know. These, they just, I don't know, we'll see. That one down there is really nice. But, one thing at the time, at the U Dizzy shop, working on the Model A, chugging away. Woo! Look at this sticker. Oh, tough doggy. Junk star. Comment, like, subscribe. Check out the links below. Get your hardcore U Dizzy swag.